So I get a lot of questions, should you invest in a hedge fund or a mutual fund? Let me answer that in this video. What's up, Tim Sykes, millionaire mentor and trader here coming to you because I wanna answer your questions. Leave questions below this video. I'm gonna answer these questions. I'm gonna make videos expounding on simple thoughts. I'm gonna go into details because I want you to be as successful as possible. And if I can somehow give you a few nuggets of wisdom from my 20 plus years of experience, I kinda have to, I kinda want to, I need to. That is how I live, that's what gives me meaning these days. So I'm fully, fully invested in making you successful. Leave comments, leave questions just below this video and I'm gonna review them all. Why? Because I'm crazy and because I absolutely love my job of teaching. I'm a good trader but I'm a better teacher and it's fantastic to bring this whole community of traders together. Every single one of us is important. I don't care if you have a $500 account or $500,000 account. I answer everybody and I wanna teach everybody. Remember, my first millionaire student was also my first hater so if you're skeptical of me, that's fine. There's still a chance. Just give me a chance to show you what I've got. So today's video is all about, you know, should you invest in a hedge fund? Should you invest in a mutual fund? What are the differences? I don't think you should invest in anybody else other than yourself. You should invest in your own knowledge. Any hedge fund, any mutual fund can say anything, and many of them do. Wall Street is like a you know dog and pony show, but that doesn't mean that you should trust them. Why not be self-sufficient? All of my top students have studied their butts off learning my strategy, learning my rules, learning my patterns, and you don't even have to learn from me, okay? I'm not saying that I know everything, I'm very far from perfect, but at least take tidbits and little nuggets of wisdom from me and other top traders who share it. That way, you don't need to rely on anybody else. I know many of you guys have jobs and you have school and you don't have time to learn and you just wanna give your money to somebody. Don't be that lazy. You work hard for your money. You can't trust anybody on Wall Street. I don't care what they say, I've heard everything. Remember, 70% plus of mutual fund managers don't even beat the S&P 500 every year and the S&P 500 goes up eight to 10%. So it's fine if you wanna make like 5% on your money every year, that's fine. If you want to be totally lazy and do that, that's great. But for me, there's so much more opportunity and you can now learn everything on the internet. So mutual funds, they basically invest in a big basket of stocks. So instead of just buying one stock, you buy a mutual fund and then you're basically invested in like 50 stocks or 100 stocks. The problem comes in is if the market is down and you're in 50 stocks and they're all down. You haven't diversified, you're just thinking that you're diversified. And in bad years, mutual funds have dropped 20%, 30%, even 50%, just like individual stocks. So a lot of people think that they're safe in mutual funds, they're not, that's just marketing. Um, hedge funds are kind of like mutual funds on steroids. They can bet in big groups of stocks and investments and all kinds of investments, but they can also short sell, they can bet against assets. So if they think that you know China is gonna have a bad year, they can invest a lot of money into the US and European uh, markets markets and then bet against China. So you're hedged, right? So you're long some and then you're short some and theoretically you can do better. And that has produced some outsized gains. Um, but again, I just don't want to give my money to anybody else, okay? I don't trust anybody else. So if it were me, if you're asking me, would I, you know, random person, invest in a mutual fund or hedge fund. No, I would invest in myself. I would invest in my future and in my knowledge. Read books galore, study when you can. If you have a job or school during the day, give yourself an hour at night every single night. Study on the weekends, maybe study an hour per weekend. Maybe study for five hours on the weekend. The internet changes everything, okay? It's not just about how much money you can make, it's how much knowledge can you acquire. And when you acquire enough knowledge, you can use that knowledge to acquire a lot of money over time. That is the best investment that you can make. Time and education. Mutual funds and hedge funds, fantastic if you're totally lazy. 
I would just be careful because they're just not geared towards making you rich. They're geared towards accumulating as much assets as possible and then they take little management fees and hedge funds actually take a cut of the profits. So hedge funds are riskier um, but they're more flexible and they're also more expensive because the manager takes a cut um, of the profits. A lot of hedge funds have made ridiculous amounts of money in one year or two years and then all the people at the hedge fund get bonuses based on year-end numbers and then oftentimes the hedge funds stink year two year three after the big year because they've already made enough money they're not incentivized anymore like they've already made 50 100 200 million dollars individually as managers they're just not on the same level anymore. They kind of like lost the eye of the tiger. Mutual funds don't really have that many outsized uh, performance gains like that year after year after year. And for me, I just want to use the stock market to get rich. I mean, that's what I did. And in order to do that, you need to learn niche strategies. And the cool thing is you can learn everything online. Um, at no time in history before the past few years have you been able to learn every single thing online. I learned it all the hard way. You don't necessarily have to learn it the hard way. You can learn from me. I'm here to you know, try to uh, cut down your learning time. And that's what I think about hedge funds, mutual funds, and education. Invest in your education. Invest in yourself. Don't trust anybody else. Cheers. Hey, Tim Sykes, Millionaire Mentor and Trader. Thank you for watching my videos. I hope that they help you. I wanna share everything that I've learned over the years. You can check out more videos right over there. And also click subscribe so that you can watch all of these videos, get that knowledge, and become my next millionaire student.